My name is Dr. Craig Chappell. Uh, I'd like to uh, show you some of the uses for ultrasound, specifically in the, in the application of nerve problems, uh, nerve issues, nerve entrapments, those types of things. A lot of people don't know the utility of ultrasound in, in assessing or uh, diagnosing uh, nerve complaints, nerve entrapment syndromes, whatever it may be. So I just wanted to give you a quick demo of what you can uh, see with ultrasound. Uh, so this is uh, an ultrasound. In this case, we're looking at the anterior elbow or the, where the elbow joint from the front side. Um, the first thing we notice is we can see all the way to the bone, uh, which is down here. We see the scalloped appearance of the bone. And on top of it, we have a muscle called the brachialis. Next to that, we have the uh, brachial artery. And right next to that, we have the median nerve. So right here in this, in this area is the median nerve. We can actually see it very, very well as we scan up uh, through the arm, scan down through the arm. Um, we can see it uh, dive underneath uh, the pronator teres muscle. So you can see it as far as common entrapment sites, we can see that pretty well. We can also see muscles. We can see tendon. Uh, this is the biceps tendon up here, this hyperechoic or very bright white thing. The beating things are obviously vessels. Um, those are pretty easy to see, super easy to see. If you put on uh, color, um, you'll see them light, light right up. So the utility of this um, is basically, if I had a structure I needed to hit, for this case, the or inject or do a hydrodissection on the median nerve, there's a few other structures in the way that I probably want to avoid. Same thing if I go a little bit lateral on the elbow. What I'm looking at here now is a couple muscles. So this is uh, brachialis here, uh, brachioradialis here, uh, and in between the two, I see another nerve. It's very bright, very white. I can see it readily here. This is called the radial nerve. If I follow that radial nerve down, I see a little artery sweep underneath it. And then I see a nerve here and a nerve here. And if you watch close, you'll see them bifurcate or split apart. So this would represent the superficial branch of the radial nerve. And this would represent the deep branch of the radial nerve. The deep branch of the radial nerve oftentimes gets entrapped in this part of the, of the elbow call, called the arcade of Froch. Um, and it goes through this muscle called the supinator. But you can see I can track that nerve right through the supinator into the back of the arm. And this utility goes on and on as far as where I can see it. I can see it in the axilla, um, in the knees, in the ankles, wherever it may be. And the technology is such now that we can see the nerves down to 0.25 millimeters. So even the, the distal nerves or the very, very small nerves for those strange pains or neuropathies or numbness that can't be figured out or explained by other reasons. The reason being is nerves, when they become entrapped, they swell up, and we can actually see that now on imaging. And if we dissect or uh, test, uh, inject those areas, your pain gets better, it goes away, probably that's the problem site, which will lead to different treatment options. But most of all, I just want to showcase or show you the possibilities that exist uh, with ultrasound and nerve cases. Thanks.